Hey guys, this is Tommy Hall with MathNook.com and I'm here to go over MathPup Angles Bone Pathway Game. Now, um, this game can be found by going to the MathPup Angles link off the first page on MathNook or the home page. And uh, if you click that link to the MathPup Angles series game of games, you will see uh, the five MathPup Angles games. And the other games are Bubble Shoot, MathPup Angles Finding Bones, and MathPup Angles matching pairs. There's actually two matching pairs games, one uh, basic and one advanced. Now these games could also be found on MathPup Games, which you can click the link here in the game, or just go to www.mathpup.com. The, um, the mathpup.com has uh, all the games there are uh, will play on tablets and mobile devices as well as PCs. So the games on MathNook now we're moving more towards games that play on both devices, um, all the all the devices, PCs and mobile devices. But uh, a lot of the games on MathNook require a mouse, so you may not be able to play those on your tablet or mobile uh, mobile device. So, anyways, let's take a look at the game. And when you start up, the game is going to look like this. You can see this menu here. If you click on the question mark, it gives you the instructions in case you need to go over those. But we're going to I'm going to show you how the game plays, so there's really no need to do that. Let's go ahead and click this to go to the game. Now, the object of the game is to figure out the angle between Math Pup and the bone. And if you guess, uh, if you once you figure out the angle, then you'll click the right answer down here, one of three answers. And if you get it right, it will go to Math Pup. Now. Right now, the uh, protractor isn't do you, doing you much good because you can't really tell exactly what this angle is. You might be able to guess it, but we want to be a little bit more exact, so we will need to move that over where we can um, measure the angles. Now, these buttons here are the way you do it, as well as these. These um, buttons here will move you clockwise, and these buttons will move the uh, protractor counterclockwise. This will move it in one degree increments, five degree increments, and ten degree increments. So let's go ahead and get the protractor moved over where it will actually help us measure the angle. Now I could go, let's go ahead and uh, you can see me fine tune it here, put it right on the zero. This is on the zero and this is on, if you go over there, 80 degrees. But I could also do the uh, uh, other way and measure with zero down here, zero down here, and you still get 80 degrees, which you'd expect. So let's go ahead and click 80, and you'll see it go down. I'm not sure it's correct. Now. Okay, now that we see it go straight to them, to Math Pup, we know that we and it got the right angle. It says you got the right angle. Now if I come over here, let's go ahead and do that again. Let's go ahead and put that on zero. I'm going to back off a little bit. I'd like to put the zero. You can pretty much tell what the angle it is 70, but I kind of like to put it right on the, there. It's right on zero here. You may not be able to tell in the video, but right there on zero, and that's 70. Let's go ahead and get a wrong answer. And I chose 80 when it's actually 70, and you see that it goes off a little bit. And MathPup's really not too happy about that because he will growl a little bit and tell you that, uh, yeah, that you missed. So, uh, anyways, that's how you play. Um, if you have any questions about the game, you can watch this video again or go back to, to the main menu and uh, hit the question mark and I'll give you the instructions. I hope this helps some, and thanks for watching.